In this video, I'm going to show you how to create this mass transition effect in Premiere Pro. Stick around. Tyler here from Video Editing with Tyler White, and if you want to learn how to edit video like a pro, start now by subscribing and hitting the bell so you don't miss anything. So here inside Premiere Pro, I already have my two clips down on the timeline. I have the first clip here, and I'm going to transition from this clip to the second clip here. So the first thing I'm going to do is select that clip. Then I'm going to go down here and I'm just going to find, kind of find the spot on the clip where I want the effect to begin. Right there looks pretty good for me. It's going to be whenever she first kind of walks into the frame. Then I'm going to go over here under effects controls and I'm going to go down to opacity. I'm going to select the pen tool. Then what I'm going to do is start creating a mask. So I'm going to go over here and change this to 100%. Then I'm going to kind of mask out the area behind her head. And the more time you take on this, the better this effect is going to look. Once I've started that mask, I'm then gonna go over here. I'm gonna check the box for inverted. And then I wanna click this stopwatch here because I'm going to animate this mask. Select the mask again. Then I'm gonna go frame by frame until my subject has walked completely out of the shot. It's important to take your time with this because the more precise you are with this mask, the better and more natural the effect is going to look. I'm gonna go to the next frame, fix my mask. I'm gonna go frame by frame and adjust the mask until I've completely masked out my clip. Once you have everything masked out, I'm then gonna go over here to fit. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring that first clip up on that second video layer, and then I'm gonna bring that second video underneath. One thing that you'll also have to do is get rid of this little spot right here. So in order to do that, all you simply have to do is go down here, go to the very beginning of your mask, click on your mask, go to the very first keyframe in your mask, then I'm just gonna go over one, and I'm just going to slide that mask path over. Then when I play it back, Looks pretty smooth. So in here there are a little bit of sharp edges. So in order to kind of fix that, I'll play around with the feather. Just kind of make it look a little bit more natural. And then I'll go ahead and play it back. And that looks pretty good to me. Continue to perfect your skills by checking out this video. Edit like a pro by subscribing and hitting the bell so you don't miss anything. I'll see you in the next video.